Hey everybody, welcome back to Ready Steady Play. It's episode three of Joan of Arc, the Battle of Creasy. 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 Which is this epic fight that I'm about to end by interrupting all his turn. Ugh. I'm going to interrupt your turn with one of my valuable interrupt tokens here. Obviously, I'm going to put it here with the archers because the more I can shoot the English archers, the better my life will be. Hey, look, a distraction. Duh. I'm sorry, Mike, you've not got a flag. You need to put another one down. No, I need that flag. That Michael so beautifully added the stickers to. <laughs> yeah. I'm really trying to think of a nice word then. <laughs> it took me a while. Beautifully, yeah. So I've got... Uh... Uh, I've got uh, some thoughts on what I want to do here. Oh, God, of course you've got thoughts. Just do it. It's just difficult. Just do it. I will activate uh, the Earl of Earl. It's going to be really funny when Editor Mike has to do this bit. There's going to be so much of his own silence he's chopping out. Oh, God. Holly, the options. The options. The options. Just be impetuous like I am. <laughs> it's clearly working out for me. Yeah, yeah it's clearly. It's, well, I, it's hard to tell. Isn't it? It's very hard to tell. Well, he's going to reach over into this area here. Hey, you guys! Over there! He's going to activate these archers who are going to move into here. Um, I think moving these archers into here might be more fun. Actually. And useful. Okay. Uh, this guy, the Earl of Chandos will activate uh, these guys and they're going to shoot into this space here. It's not going to have much of an effect on the play. Bloody well hope not. Arcing arrows! Blast! Nothing. Oh wait, no, that becomes a disrupt because I'm English archers. Okay, so what do I get for the forest? I get an extra white die? Well, extra white die. Right, so I get an extra white die then I get two. So we get Philip who has two black dice and when he defends he cancels a push which you're not got. Mm -hmm. Get the white dice then I got the Vulgars, who are two and that. So, I need Yeah, I'm good. Only just though. Only just. Jesus. <laughs> We've got very aggressive dice rolls. You know what's going to happen now? Yeah, I'm going to whiff every attack I make. Yeah, every other shield you get, yeah. Um, I'm going to put uh, then these guys are going to move he's going to move back there. I'll take the blacksmith with him. That's my personal blacksmith now. And the Earl of... He looks pretty great to me. Arendelle. Well, should I talk to the blacksmith again? I just don't know if I can be bothered. I mean, I just want you to make your mind up. This okay. is my turn. God damn it. We'll talk to the blacksmith again. <laughs> should I be taking out the other cards once you've No, used... it doesn't say to do that. Okay. Plays Joan of Arc. Spends, From the bottom. Oh, plays Joan of Arc. Spends most of the game talking to a blacksmith. Pronounce his name. Do it. How is Captain... Gautier de Forez? Hmm? Um, I like the good options. I'm feeling noble. So uh, I'm going to ask about... Uh, did he kill a beast in the name of our savior? D. Not your savior. I slew a gigantic she-wolf who was terrorizing this land. She didn't go without a fight. Gained... Oh, ah. Why do you get the easy ones? Oh, is it just gain two? Draw or draw an equipment card. Gain two legendary tokens. Or, or, or draw an equipment card. And you may ask a level two question. Oh, cool. Great. I'll take these and I'll crack on. I want to continue playing the adventure, Ali. I want to play more adventure. Left or right? Left. Because that's the devil. Ah, we've managed to have both of the cards at least. Ah, I shall ask him about his techniques. Learned it. As an old craftsman told me day, they de language. <laughs> How's that French working out for you? <laughs> an old I craftsman told me one day about some age old forge techniques from the Far East that were much better than ours. Do you know them? I see Damascus steel. Yeah, exactly. And he's like, no, I know nothing about Damascus steel. And I'm like, wait a minute. Uh, slightly funny on that one. <laughs> I would not know about it, but I doubt those barbarians, blind to the light of God, could surpass us in any of the arts. Test.
blank. God damn it. <laughs> Draw an equipment card. Yay! Literally anything else was you cannot be activated for the remainder of your turn. Ugh. Is it, I guess it's a, did it say tactics? Equipment card? No. One equipment card. Then I choose legendary. <gasps> no! St. Martha's Belt. The wearer gains plus two attack against unholy characters. Well, that's not very useful. Yet. Yet. God damn it! Why are you so much better at talking to people than me? Because <laughs> I'm charismatic. I'll take him back here. Um, and then uh, I can activate uh, the Earl of... What's his face? Um, Arundel? Arundel, yeah. Isn't that the name of the kingdom from the Snow Queen? Maybe. He's going to go over here. And, make and then it, make... uh, the archer shoot. Right. All of them? Yeah. They're all going to shoot into that space with your leader that I need to kill. Uh... Wow, so these become disrupts because English archers. I just hate you right now. I really hate you right now. This might be a very short... Well, I say short. <laughs> it's been primarily him talking to people. So far, we've had three episodes of Ollie's turn. Which are primarily comprised of me talking to a blacksmith about tech, yeah. forging techniques. Right, I get an extra white for the forest. I gain two white and reds from them, and I gain two from him. Mm-hmm. And when defending, I cancel a push, so I just remove one of those pushes. Okay. Well, could be interesting. On the table, please. Uh, so just one. Wow, on the worst dice as well. Yeah, the black ones are supposed to be really good for defense. Yep. That was... They're 50-50s. That was awful. That was awful. If you can choose now to assign these three dice, you must try and decide one dice to each unit. So I'm going to put Wound on Philip. So you're going to put the Disrupt on Philip? Yeah. Rather than taking off one of the Halberds? Actually, no, because that's... He dies. Yeah, that's yep. precisely their purpose. Yep. Okay. So um, these uh, two must be pushed. So he's well, got... Well, I, I select where. You can't, because there's only one legal place for him to go. Yeah, but if I go here, then they have to come in here. Yeah. But he can't move into the town. So... Yeah, I accept this. I just uh, I just wanted to split them. Oh, I got that. How's my turn working out for you? <laughs> yeah, good. I'm enjoying it. Back to you. Crescent, fasten, crescent, dasen, crescent. Right. Uh, what, what do I want to do? I often have those thoughts. I know, but you send, like, words. Words. I just, I just act, activate the archers. Yeah. Uh, I, ooh, because if I charge them, they'll charge there and attack. Yeah. That could be a thing. And then those poor archers are probably going to be killed. Yes, but what I could also do is do that, move them into there, and then do it with the other guys, because your barricades give you additional bits. Mm-hmm. So let's do there. Charge with midnights. So they actually have to go one, two, and then charge into this space here. Yes, and there I, is room for them. Yeah, yeah, there's plenty of room for them. Now, I think you get a bonus for charging through the fields, Ollie, and I get a bonus for having the barricades. So you, I get one additional white die, Yep. What and you I cannot get? follow up after combat, but if you win, you will remove the stakes. Um, and you, who came through the plane slash field, you may re-roll a die. Cool. But only because everything was planes and fields that you moved through. Shut up and die. No! I mean, that's pretty good. It's not good enough. Why not? Because I want to have swords. <laughs> right, because you want experience points? But you've already got three. I know. Show. Oh, I get two. Show me a shield, please. Yay! So they're disrupted. And then this goes away, and you must stay in here. So literally, that's gotten me nothing, because they're going to come back. Uh, well, you never know. You never know. <sighs> Gross. All right. Going to use another interrupt? I'm considering it. No. Good. Okay. Really tempted to do another charge. Let's move these guys. Into there. 
Right, so the question is, do I want to try to protect those archers? Because I think it's fairly apparent what you're trying to do here. <laughs> you don't know me. You don't know me. Um, oh, I would like to try and protect those archers. But I don't know what I can do to... Die oh, with oh, wait, no yes, of course dignity. I can. I know exactly what I can do. Oh, no. Um, die with no dignity. Sounds about right. It's worth a shot. I interrupt. Of course you do. To activate this space. Yep. I'm not going to talk to the blacksmith because I think we've all had enough of that. <laughs> I'm going to use, uh, I'm going to activate, um, <laughs> I'm going to activate Edward the Third's uh, command ability. Yep. He's going to go into this hex here. Yep. Which can activate John Chandos's um, command ability as well. Oh no. Um, Goddamn mercenary. John Chandos is going to... I feel like we're playing different games. <laughs> John Chandos is going to spend his one adjacent activation point to... Okay, so he moves these foot soldiers in here, and then he moves in here, and then I've still got two more units from this hex I can activate with this command ability here. We're going to send uh, the sergeant at arms into here, and now that hex is at capacity anyway. Um, Where's my sergeant at arms card? There it is. I'm looking at it. Why am I not seeing this thing literally in front of me? And then what we'll I swear do we actually know what we're doing. is we'll activate these guys who... Well, they've already activated. They'll come in here. Huh? Well, this was all just command abilities. A chain of command abilities. Wow. You moved more with command abilities than I've moved with actual movement. Command abilities, I think, are really designed to be used to consolidate your forces. I wouldn't know. <laughs> okay. Back to you, Ollie. Right, what defense are you at rocking now? In that space? Yeah. Uh, it's not that good, actually. I've got three reds and three whites, but uh, the three reds all have retaliation on them. Ah, what the hell. <laughs> I need you to die. Dun, 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 dun. Well, it's going to be an epic fight. Yeah, what's going to be funnier is when I attack this space instead, because that's where one of your characters are. Yeah. And they don't have retaliate, do they? Um, well, they have all kinds of other nonsense going on. But they don't have retaliate. Uh, yeah, two of them do. Ah, oh. These two units have retaliate. <sighs> the pikemen don't. So what's the... That's Edward? Or the Black Prince? That's the Black Prince. This is Edward over here. Okay. Edward's uh, actually my... Pr I, I, I thought the Black Prince would be my like super leader, but actually it's Edward. Edward's nonsense. Okay, so what have you got? You've got so much death coming in, right? Yeah, it's just, what, do I want to try and take out a character and get a decent amount of wounds going on you? Or do I want to try on your other character where I'm definitely going to be feeling the death? What's more interesting? <laughs> should I go for the victory or should I go for the silly? I think we both know what I'm doing. Can I have some more red dice, please? Uh, yeah. What do you need? Uh, oh, I've got three. <laughs> Just give me all of them. Right, I've got three cavalries in there, and then pikemen who are all whites. So three, six reds and three whites? Yep. Ooh. Um, I've got to take out your archers. It's killing me. <laughs> but I'm not going to. I'm going to go after the Black Prince. Okay, so you're attacking into this space here? Yeah. So, which you get a bonus for, don't you? Oh, no. Why do I get bonus for it? Because of stakes. I, but aren't they on the wrong side? I hope so. I think stakes are specific side. While you sort out your attack roll, I'll double check. Wait! The Black Prince is Terra 1. What does that mean? You have to roll a yellow die, and if you get a push result, I can choose one of your units who doesn't attack. Uh, uh, that's not good. I'm going to go after your archers then. <laughs> okay. We're reconfiguring the charge! Rules are important. <laughs> Oh, God damn, I'm terrible at this. That's not too bad, I don't think. I'm not getting any swords. <laughs> I want the swords. I want to be able to kill you. <laughs> Is that so oh, much to ask? I want to kill you too, Ollie. But I wanted to kill you for longer. <laughs> I want to, I want it more. <laughs> I just wanted to just outright murder you. Why? Why must the dice betray me? So uh, we, what we've got here is... The, the shields are worthless to you, right? Yes. Okay. So we've got four disrupts, two pushes, and a kill. 
So my defense roll is going to be three red dice. Um, and it's going to be, because that's Sergeant at Arms, I've got uh, Foot Knights, they had a black one. Uh, Sergeant at Arms is one red one, and then John Chandos is a red one. So this is one pool, because that has retaliation on it. And then the three white ones for the arches, which are just separate. Okay. Oh, and I've got uh, the Foot Knights who cancel a push when defending. Okay. Dun 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 dun. Blanks, blanks. That's so that's really bad. two disrupts that you're going to take, um, and a push that you're also going to take. Well, I think we both know who that's going on. <laughs> and then we've got uh, the archer's white dice, which has one defense on it to cancel the kill, and then four disrupts. Um, I have to assign, and these are worthless. Okay, so I've got to assign these to my units. And you've got to assign those to your units. Already did. Cool. Okay. I'm going to push these guys over here. Okay. <laughs> Back through the stakes. <laughs> ow! Ow! <laughs> ow! Okay, so four disrupts, huh? Who do we want to lose? The infirmary's looking really busy. Is there a, is there a maximum occupancy? Because I feel like we filled it already. So I think we're going to lose the archers. Although I love them to bits. Um, and uh, then uh, we're going to take one wound on John Chandos. Okay. How many has he got left? Oh, and then there's a push as well. Yep. Um, so select... Uh, and I will put the push down on Chandos. So... He has to go to an adjacent yep, area. There we go. All right. All right. So that's that. Yep. Um, I'm going to bank this one. The, the reactivate. Yes. <gasps> Is that the end of your turn? Ooh, I could just kill, couldn't I? Because reactivate is for the same one. Hmm... No, I'm not going to bother. I've burned through too much already. That's my turn. Mike's turn! Next time on Ready, Steady, Play. Oh my god. Episode 4, the big Mike's first turn. Come back and join us for it. I hope that you are enjoying this battle. We, I think things are going to start heating up now that Ollie's broken through the front lines. Finally! Bye, everyone! Bye! I've got such disappointing orders, though, now. I've used all my interesting orders. Oh, boo, freaking... <laughs> 